This is a 51-year-old male with a history of panhypopituitarism. There is a well-circumscribed, solid-appearing T1 slightly hypointense, T2 flare mildly hyperintense mass with diffusion restriction and enhancement. The lesion, enlarge, the lesion enlarges the cell ursica with a component which spills into and enlarges the supracellar compartment. There is elevation of the infundibulum. No cavernous sinus invasion is seen. The lesion contacts and superiorly displaces and deforms the optic chiasm and prechiasmatic segments of the optic nerves. There is chronic remodeling and erosion of the posterior wall of the cell ursica with elevation of the periosteal surface extending towards the prepontine cistern. The differential diagnosis includes pituitary macroadenoma, pituocytoma, granular cell tumor of the pituitary gland, and astrocytoma of the neurohypophysis, among others. This was a biopsy-proven pituocytoma. Pituocytomas arise from pituocytes, which are specialized glial cells in the neurohypophysis and infundibulum. The peak incidence is in the fifth decade, with a female-to-male ratio of 2 to 1. Clinical presentation is either from endocrine dysfunction or from compression of adjacent structures. Asymptomatic lesions also occur.